right, the journal is all finished. She is a chunker. Here's one side. Where's the front? And then the back. So let's open her up, take a peek. This is just tied with some sorry silk. And here on the front, we have a window pocket with some embroidered trim here on the front. There's a tag here with a charm. And this does open up to reveal another pocket with a little tag. This is a coin envelope with a little card inside. And then these two tags. And then I'll put a book plate here on the front with a little card that I stamped with journal when that comes out. Okay, when you open it up, there is a little half circle tuck here with two tags. did some gold eyelash trim. I I did not do a lot of trimming in this book because because it is so large, but the recipient can of course decorate more, but I wanted to put at least a little bit in there. So each of these sections has a planner, diary, whatever you want to call it. There are 5 weeks in each signature for a total of 12 signatures. And then the back half of each signature is plain. That you can write on or add pictures or whatever you want to do. And then we have this pocket with some more little trim and some bling. And this lays relatively flat, so it did not bulk up the journal too much. So we turn the page, we have a little side tuck here with another little coin envelope. Another signature, all of the signatures are, signatures are exactly the same. So it's a total of five pages, which would give you 20 uh, pages altogether in each signature. Here's some more lace. And here's a little corner tuck with these. Another signature. There's a belly band, the next signature, and then we have this half circle tuck with these. And then this tiny little tuck here at the top with a journal card. And the next signature. And then there's a signature, and here is a side tuck with an envelope. It's a journal card inside. And then we're at the back of the journal. So this opens up to reveal a little scrap note pad that's just pad that's tied in with some seam binding. 
we have the number 47 here, which represents the 47th journal that I've ever made. And that closes with Velcro. And then we have another window pocket here with a large tag. And a little collage here on the front. The This and this is from Artie Mays, uh, her July freebie kit that you can find on Kofi. Okay, then you start it up again. And here is an envelope full of goodies that you can add to the journal. They're all cut out and ready to go. And here's signature. The next planner or signature. We have a pocket here with these three. A little upper tuck with an envelope. This is empty. You can put some little secret things in there. Another little upper tuck with two tags. The next signature. And here we have an envelope with a little tag inside. Actually, it is a trifold. We'll tuck here with these. In the pocket. Some little blingy stuff. Next signature. Oops, we got some stickage. We have these three. This is actually another one of those coin envelopes with a little card inside. On the signature. And here we have another trifold. And now we're back to the front of the journal. So all in all, there are 13 tags. I had to do 13 so that I could have 12 uh, hinges to sew in a signature. So there's a signature, there are 12 signatures in the entire journal, one for each month. Lots of tags and cards and spaces to tuck things. So I have to tell you, this this was an absolute labor of love, cutting all of this stuff out and, and getting it into the journal. But I love the way it turned out. I hope you, you enjoyed that. Um, I will be listing this in my Etsy shop. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you'll give it a try. This is a really cool way to document a year in your life. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Bye.